What do you do if you're a surrogate and you've got to go on television and defend this cascade of, of accusations about Donald Trump? Well, you need to unskew the accusations, right? We all remember when Romney's people had to unskew the polls because there were certain facts that they didn't like. Well, here's how you unskew the accusations. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Katrina Pearson, who apparently Peter Beinart is so flummoxed by this that he almost doubles over and falls out of his seat laughing. And, and to be clear, if you don't know Peter Beinart, I mean, he's one of the more sort of polished, serious. I mean, he's very no I've actually, I've actually um, was on a couple of CNN hits with him years ago and tried to make a couple of jokes. And it was one of those people who were like, oh, no, uh, that's actually not accurate. <laughs> exactly. Like, I'm like, oh, all right. I, yeah, I was making a joke. Ah. But do you believe, Katrina? Do you believe? Pause First, it, pause let it. Let me just say. Let, let me just uh, clarify. Jessica Leeds is the uh, woman who accused uh, Donald Trump in the early 80s of they were on a flight together heading off to New York. Trump raised the armrest separating them, grabbed her breast and tried to put his hands up her skirt. And so how do you respond to those accusations? I give you Katrina Pierce. But do you believe Katrina? Do you believe Jessica Leeds? First, let me just say that this is the exact same New York Times that WikiLeaks has already posted emails from reporters. But my at the question New York is Times initially, you can talk about that, but my campaign. initial question is, do second, you believe Jessica Leeds? Second, Leeds? I would like to address. There were several things Katrina, just said that I'd like to. Katrina, respond to I would like you to answer my question, question and on. if you're going to go on and, and pivot, you can do that. <laughs> but can you answer my question directly first? This is what do happens you believe, to Trump people. What's okay, your question, Jessica, Don? My question. This, I, this is not what happens to Trump people. It's what happens to everyone who comes on and they don't answer the question that I ask and they immediately pivot to something else. So my question to you is: Do you believe Jessica Leeds' account that this happened uh, 30 years ago on an airplane? I do not believe it at all. It is 100% patently false. And as I was saying, this is the exact same New York Times that tried the same stunt back in March. And then those women came forward and debunked that article. But this is why this story is particularly ridiculous, to answer your question more thoroughly. We're talking about the early 1980s, Don. Seriously? Back then you had planes, what, a DC-9, a DC-10, an MD-80, 707, and maybe an L-1011? But she said specifically this was to New York, and this is what's important, because so we can X out the L-1011 and the DC-10. Guess what? First class seats have fixed armrests. So what I can tell you about her story, if she was okay. roped on a plane, uh, it Katrina, wasn't we'll by get Donald our, Trump, we'll get our aviation wasn't expert. first class. We'll, okay, get, our, one we'll down get our 11 aviation to go. expert here uh, to talk how about the airplane. How can it happen? Explain how that happens. There are fixed seats on first class. So if it happened, it wasn't by Donald Trump, and Katrina, it wasn't Katrina, there are more than class. six seats Donald in Trump first class. There, sometimes the there are... Or she said fixed. Yeah, fixed. Oh, fixed. I thought she said six seats. But listen, I'm not going to... I'm not going to... F-I-X. ED. Okay. We don't know what kind of plane they were on. We don't know what the seats were like. So I'm not going to I'm not going to argue options. about that. That's not all the options, okay? Donald uh, Trump had his own plane Katrina, in the 80s. Katrina, I'm not going to argue about an airplane fly. now. I want we're, let's talk about the Why woman here who says she's a victim. What, what, what about these her story? Have to it's gain false. by coming out. Yeah. They, what did these women have to here's gain why by she coming said out she and finally Here's why she said she finally spoke out. Fame. That's why these women came out fame. I mean, look at me. Look what I'll do for fame. I'll go on and, and pretend like I'm an uh, aeronautics professional and say that it's impossible that these seats were raised. So she was absolutely lying. Plus, on top of that, Donald Trump had his own airplane. He didn't even fly uh, first class on commercial jets ever. Corey Lewandowski looks like he's trying not to laugh. It seems like there's a lot of people trying not to laugh. Uh, Even Corey Lewandowski's like, dude. Whoa. <laughs> that was pretty sweet. Katrina Pearson. You'll have a DC-9. You'll have a Boeing. You'll have Airbus. <laughs> don't, don't take an, Believe me, I have attempted to sexually hot ass woman in the 80s on first class. It is impossible. There is no way to reach your arm above... <laughs> divide her on a plate. <laughs>
Does anybody here think, does anybody here think that Donald Trump was not up in the lounge area, which used to exist on those Peter Pan flights? Unbelievable. See, the best bit that reminded me of, remember one time this, I forget who did it, but someone tweeted something very snarkily about, because it was like, you know, I admire Katrina Pearson for being able to get up and do what she does every day, and obviously it was not meant as a compliment, <laughs> and, and she retweeted it. <laughs> so that was like that segment, because she's, she's like walking, she's just like nailed it. They had nothing on the DC-9, I said fixed. You guys are morons. I mean, here's the question. Here, here's, here's, here's the real question. On one hand, do you, um, if you're Katrina Pearson, do you go to like crisis management places and be like, no one has done what I've done? And you get hired, or do they look at you and go like, dude, I'm sorry, you're associated with Donald Trump. Do they go, no one has done what you yeah, done? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Hey, it's Sam Cedar. Why don't you uh, subscribe to this channel? You can do so right, uh, right over here. Uh, so over. Subscri subscribe.